Damin Demjanović, co-founder of Health Tech Lab, together with Dr. Ivana Kostić. And we are, uh, we are working last two years together. Uh, started working on the first MIT uh, Med Hackathon in Serbia. Since then we organized uh, tennis meetups. Uh, we were part of many conferences and taking in being in charge in the health part of the on those conferences like fab belgrade uh, like smart city conference like uh, so tell us what is the future of virtual reality uh, oh i i think after what i see uh, these two days i'm sure it's bright uh, i'm sure that uh, the the young people that we are start speaking that those young people are born with the VR. It was like with the computers, you know, there are generation without computers and generation born with computers. Now we're going to have generation born with VR because what we saw that the VR is going to have a live broadcast with the 5G that will, this will for sure be a big interruption of everything we, we, we thought the future will be. And especially with those VRs that are now totally standalone with no cables, no, no need for, for computers because everything will be on 5G, 4G, wireless. It's, it's amazing. It's really amazing. And it gives so much possibilities, uh, especially in the health sector. I always think about quadriplegic, quadriplegic people and people that need some sort of support. The VR will for sure give them some beautiful, much better and brighter future than they have today. So, so if you think about the, the, the society we live in and the ecosystem, who will shape the future? Uh, the kids. The kids will shape the future and the people in need because they know exactly what they need. <laughs> and kids will have much better idea than we have it today. And I'm sure we're going to see them on the finals. So many great new ideas that we didn't even thought about them till now. So, the the always the future is on kids. Tell me, how do you benefit from your engagement in things like the European Youth Award now the Social Hackathon? What's the benefit you take from? Uh, is it always need a benefit to be a part of something big? No, but the benefit is being with so bright young people, learning so much about VR. So I benefit. Pff, much more than I supposed to, and I'm really grateful for it. And I, I, I hope you'll call us the next time also. We are really appreciating. Where do you find uh, the motivation to do everything, like all the things you do and all the startups and uh, sort of starting initiatives? I don't know. They all usually tell me I'm crazy, so I take it as granted. But. Uh, uh, maybe making brighter future for my child and or other childs. Uh, I see, you know, the, we are in a part of Europe that wasn't so stable in the last couple of decades. So everything nice and new that's coming should be taken, not as a granted, but something we, we need to work on and fight for. Because the life is a fight from the born to the end. And... Uh, some of us experience and understand that when they get chronic disease or something else. Some, some of us understand that prior to anything bad happening to him, but everybody has his own story while he's trying to, to, to do something good and nice. Do you want to shout out a message to the young entrepreneurs of Serbia? Uh, be bold. Be bold. Don't hesitate and be brave. And VR is also future, try it if you didn't. Who knows, it can maybe change your project you're working on right now and give you some new flash on it.